Y'all, this is Jeremiah McPherson. Hallelujah. Johnson right back at y'all. We on day 105 of Mortal Kombat training. And yeah, it's a good day. Got some good sleep, some good recovery sleep. Been consistently working, putting out content. We got 1,825 days of simple discipline. 1,825 days of studying. 1,825 days of building myself and teaching myself how to think. 1,825 days of working out, 1,825 days of boxing, 1,825 days of doing porn, 1,825 days of tracking my calories, 1,825 days of going to work, 1,825 days of consistently working, 1,825 days of reading and listening to audiobooks, 1,825 days of recording content, 1,825 days of journaling, 1,825 days of keeping it pimping. 1,825 days of staying so icy on these bitches. 1,825 days of Mongol mentality. 1,825 days of sticking to my values. 1,825 days of working on my strategy. We got a few things that I'm grateful for. I'm grateful I got another porn done yesterday. I'm grateful to have the mind and to be building myself and teaching myself how to think from the environment that I come from, from the tattoos, from my slang, the way I talk, the way I am. I'm grateful to come from that type of environment, have my mind still, and to be constantly building myself and teaching myself how to think. To be a productive member of society. I'm grateful to be going to work, studying, reading, learning new things every day, making my own lane in life. It feels good to make my own lane in life. Plan 5150 for today. All the gaslighting and hating these rappers and celebrities and groupies like um, Jocko, Jay-Z, Beyonce, Rihanna, who else? Uh, Sauce Walker, Drea Mitchell, um, Tiger. Um, all that gaslighting and hating that they do. That they do Cause I don't want to fuck with them. Or need to fuck with them. Kanye West, Kim Kardashian. They suffer from a mental trauma or mental disorder or some type of mental illness. Y'all mentally sick, Jocko. I don't need to fuck with you. I I'll just walk away. Uh, C. T. Fletcher, Hawk, a lot of these other fitness professionals and porn stars that was hating on me. Y'all mentally sick. And this is a war. And. I wish you luck and stay out of my way. So we're going to hit this read wise up for today. The first passage on my read wise is from my now some personal training course. Stretch your knowledge. This is about blood pressure. Systolic blood pressure. SBP is the pressure in the arteries and other blood vessels when the heart be is beating or contracting. It is the first number, top number recorded. Dystolic blood pressure, B and D, B, P, is the pressure in the arteries and other blood vessels when the heart is at rest or between beats. It is the second bottom number recorded. Blood pressure is classified as follows. Less than 120 over 80 is normal, healthy. Elevated blood pressure is between 120 and 129 over less than 80 that's elevated blood pressure hypertension stage one is systolic 130 to 139 over dystolic between 80 to 89 hypertension two uh, systolic is 140 or higher over dystolic 90 or higher hypertension crisis is uh, anything greater than or this thought, yeah, anything greater than it, than systolic, 180, and dystolic, 120. So that's blood pressure. And this is from my MMA conditioning specialist. This is a summary. In working with today's type of clients and MMA athletes who are more likely, who are more than likely possesses muscle imbalance, Health and fitness professionals must use special consideration when designing MMA conditioning programs to help aid 
in injury prevention and recovery from intense MMA inspired workouts. Health and fitness professionals should include movement prep programs designed to address musculoskeletal dysfunctions and correct faulty movement patterns. Movement prep programs include the four phases of corrective ex exercise continuum, inhibit, lengthen, activate, integrate. Health and fitness professionals need to be proficient in teaching these programs to maximize their client's success. I'm gonna stop this one right here and then get to the next one. So, and that, that was from my MMA conditioning specialist. This is from my National Sports Nutrition Coach course. It says the stage, the stage to its correction. I think I put this um, note in my um, read wise wrong because it looks mixed, mixed up. Maybe I got distracted when I put in this note in. But uh, I'm going to skip over this one. Only had two for today. And I'm um, go back and check that note. So I'm just going to read a few quotes. And then we're going to get this workout started. We're on day 105. Consistently working. It feels good. This is from Jim Rohn. Without a sense of urgency, desire loses its value. And let's see. We got another quote here. Uh, this is from Nikio Machiavelli. War should be the only study of a prince. He should consider peace only as a breathing time, which gives him leisure to contrive and furnish as abilities to execute military plans. And let's see, one more. This is from Winston Churchill. I have nothing to offer but blood, toil, tears, and sweat. And that was one of my favorite quotes. And yeah, so this is Jeremiah McPherson. Hallelujah, Johnson. We on day 105 of Mortal Kombat training. Hey, let's do this. Let's do this shit. Been consistent. For the day, what does that mean? Your coach. Every great fighter has a coach to make sure that the fighters be the best that they can be and carry them through. So I'm gonna be sweating and and, and I'm gonna be doing everything along with y'all to make sure y'all do the best. So y'all learn body shots. So today we're gonna have body shots in this workout. So remember this bag, look at this bag. You see your face up here or the fight camp line. This is face shots. Anytime you go down, which is down with your body, that's body shots. And I want y'all to bend your legs for body shots, all right? And I only have one rule in my workout. You got to have fun. If you don't have fun, this is the wrong workout for y'all. All right, so that's no further ado. Make sure your punch track is on, your gloves are on tight, your water's right here, because your water better not be upstairs. Just be right here, and let's just get to it. We're going into jumping jacks. In three, two, one. Let's show out. Now, when we do jumping jacks, I want full range of motion. I want your hands to touch the top. Look, I don't want this. A lot of people like to jump jacks like that. I want you to touch all the way up. All right? We get ready to go into a jump rope. Right here, jump rope. Yes. Be on the balls of your foot. Muhammad Ali likes to move around. Every time he jumps around, he likes to move around. All right? You ready to go to squat? You're about to throw that jump rope. Get rid of that jump rope. Put your hands here. Squat it down. Nice and slow, y'all. Remember, we're still warming up. Come on. Five seconds, we're gonna do jump squats. But at the same time, keep your hands right by your face. All right, let's go, jump. Now, when you hear me say breathe, I want you to breathe in your nose, and then breathe out your mouth. There we go, do this whole workout. Torso twist is coming up. Ready, stand up. Torso twist, just twist your upper body. Don't move your feet yet. So you're about to punch across the body when you're going to move your feet. Stay right here. Elbows in. Hands right by the face. All right. Punch across the body. You see how I'm twisting that bottom foot every time I'm punching? That's setting you up for that two. That's setting up for the four. And the six. you out here. Hip circles coming up. Stop. Put your hands on your hips. Go to get your hips. Make sure you breathe. We're about to reverse it in five seconds. Let the game begin. 
Reverse of the way. All right, y'all. The game is about to begin. And let's have a whole lot of fun. Remember, I am your coach. I'm with you every step of the way. Check it out. All right, you're going to get in front of the bag. When you're in front of the bag, do you see how my legs are? They had a diagonal. I want that back, the rear leg, the um, heel up. I want you to squat down. Remember, the face. So we're throwing coast, one, two. This is a one with that thumb going at the diagonal. You're twisting that rear for that two. All right, so you're coasting. This is what I want. I want like a march with your feet. Just coaching. Coach, long range. The one, two, the long range. If you're in here like this, this is incorrect. I like to do long range. One, two is a made for long range, okay? The next one is body shot. Remember here or here, you want to squat your legs and throw the one, bring it back. So at the same time you squat, you throw the one. Squat, throw the one. Squat, throw the one. All right? And that's all we're doing. Punch gold is 195. But don't worry about the punch gold. Let's just get the technique, take it nice and slow. Remember, twist it. Ready, long range, coach. That's March. March. All right, y'all. So, boxing is a mental game. Everything you do in boxing is a mental game. You gotta make sure your mental game is strong. So what does that mean? That means when you're starting off something, you don't wanna be sitting there trying to go fast. Uh-uh. Calm your mind down, start slow, and let your mind understand what you are doing before you start speeding up. Because you do everything incorrect. Now we stop it. Remember, we squat, body shot. Body shot at the same time. See, I'm twisting back. You have to bend your legs. A lot of people do body shots like this. You do body shots like this, your chin is open. Huh. You, you, you be wondering, why am I getting hit in my face? Because you're not bending your legs to go down to where you're trying to hit. So you have to bend your legs, hit the body shot. That rear hand always stays up. Hey. All right, we're ready to go back to the one, two, march. Long range, let's go. One, two, march. Long range. Make sure you twist. Every time I'm twisting, I'm twisting the one, twisting the one, twisting the two. And I'm turning my rear every time I turn the two. Yes. There we go. And breathe in your nose and out your mouth. The reason why I like to go high too, it trains your body to bring your hands back. And once again, that's dealing with the mind. You're training your mind what to do. Right back to body shots. Shit. Hang. Make sure that rear hand stays up every time. Drop him. That's why squats are very important when you learn body shots. You always see if you squats, squats are perfect for the ones to the body. Body shots are one of my favorite punches to do when I'm sparring. You stop somebody from breathing, they're not coming at you no more. Let's go back to the one-two coach. At the same time, you march, march. Twist, long range. Arms should be long. Arms nice and long, not short. Long range, turn it, twist. And have a smile on your face. When you start getting tired, like, no, I'm tired. The minute you smile, for some reason, it just brings the energy back into you. You be like, yeah. That's all about having fun, the mind. Body shot, let's go. So make sure you drop in your legs, not bending your waist, do not do this. Do not drop without bending here, you bend your legs, drop, yes, there we go. Twist it to the body. Remember, you're under here, ha. perfect. Keep that rear hand up every time, ha, woo, let's get it. Eight seconds, ha, you're dropping up, drop. That's why squat is very important. You gotta have strong legs and body. There we go, shake it out. All right, y'all. We're going into the next round. We're doing fives and six. Make sure you turn that rear. So now, when you hit the fives and six, I want it more like an up jab. So when you hit the five, I'm hitting up. I'm turning that rear. When I hit that six, I'm turning that rear again. Hit, turn, 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 turn. All right? So that's the five and six. Now, when you hit the two, we got two to the body. I want you to drop first, hands up, turn that rear, and hit that two, but this is what I want you to do. As you bring that two back, I want you to stay in the squat stance and then come up. I want you to drop down, turn that rear, bring it back, stay in the squat stance, and come up, all right? 
I don't want it like this. And come on up. No. Hit the two. Bring it here. Right up. All right? So that's how I want you to do it this round. All right? Fives and six. Turning that rear. It's very important. And make sure when you hit the five and six, the palms are facing you. So here. Five. Palms facing you. Six. Palms facing you. At the same time, I'm turning that rear. Turn. Up. Turn. Up. Turn. Up. The power comes from when you open that hip up and twist from the hip. I learned that from my man, Coach Aaron and Coach Tommy. They said about twisting. Every coach should have a coach. And they're my coach. I love it. We gotta learn. All right, let's go two to the body. Remember, squat, twist that rear, bring it back, come up. Squat, twist that rear, bring it back. Up, up, up. Back up, there we go. Make sure that lead stays up the whole time. Twist that rear. Bring it back. Ha, ha. Perfect, y'all. Keep them hands up. Don't drop it. Drop them legs. Ha. You ready to go back to your post? Five to six. Let's go. Five to six. Ha, 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 ha. So if you feel good, you can start speeding up just a little bit. Not too much. Because remember I said about the mind in round one. We want to let our brain catch up first. When you feel it, that's when you start speeding up. One, two, the body shot. It's coming. Five seconds. Let's go, two. Yes, perfect. Uh-huh, drop, two. Bring it back, drop, two. Bring it back. There we go. So, this next round, I want y'all to try to give me a little bit more speed in the power, um, the, um, close, fives and six. Just a little bit, not a burnout, but just a little bit fluid. Let's go. Fluid, fluid. But make sure you twist that rear leg. Ha, ha. Twist that rear leg, twist that rear leg. Ha. Palm facing you the whole time. Make sure that it goes up to the face. Ten seconds. We do the last two to the body. I'm gonna tell y'all a little story about that two to the body. All right. So the story I have is I was sparring Aaron, and he kept hitting me with this incredible two, and it hurt. I'm like. How is he hitting me like that? It doesn't look like nothing, but it hurts. And I found out by looking at the tape, and by him telling me, I gotta start rotating my hips open. And the only way you rotate your hips open is by turning that rear hand, that rear foot, when you punch. That's why I very important to turn that rear. Good job. All right, y'all. Your nose. All right, this next round, I'm with y'all. I'm just listen. We almost done, but I'm with y'all. So the next one is the coast ones. I love one, the jab. That's the number one punch in boxing. It teaches your distance. It sets up your combinations. It sets up the power shot. Is your one. So the coast ones. Remember, I want you to hit up high. Remember, twist at the diving. I want you to hit them, them two knuckles. This is how I want that rear stays up and bring it back to your face. Don't hit and drop it as you hit it. Bring it right back to your face. Hit it right back to your face. Hit it right back to your face. It's non-stop, but you're relaxing as you're throwing the one. Then we got the power coast two. We're hitting to the face now. We're not bending down no more. Power coast two is you're hitting hard. You're right. Hitting hard, but you got to turn that rear foot. All right? So get ready. Coast one. Set. Let's go. Coach. Make sure your arms. You see how everything is long? Remember, the one shouldn't be this one. It keeps your distance. That's what the one is made for. Now, a lot of y'all shoulders might get tired from this. If you get tired, and if your shoulders get tired, don't do this. Oh my God, I'm so shoulder tired. No, why? Because this is still opponent. I want you to step away, shake it out, and come back, all right? Power coast twos, ready. Make sure you twist that rear, ha! Twist that rear foot, open up that hip, ha! Open up that hip, look at that rear foot. Remember I told you about that story about Aaron? Ah. Turn that. Ha. Keep 
keep that lean hand up. Perfect, y'all. Knock, knock, knock. So as you hit, relax, set, hit it again. Set, relax, hit it again. This ain't a burnout, this is all power. Ha. Come on. All right, we're going back to that close one. Close one. High you up to the back. Ha. Come on. I know your shoulders might be getting tired, but remember, I am your coach. I am here to tell you, you can do it. You can do whatever you put your mind to. This is what I call my favorite word. And I learned this from Floyd Mayweather. Ease that work. Ease that work. Do this in our sleep. Get ready to go back to that power coach too. Get ready. Three, two, one. Power coach two. Ha! Knock, knock. Ha! Knock, knock. Who's there? Ha! Bang on that door. Ha! Bang on that door. Turn every. Bang, bang. All right. Yes. Shoot it out. Bring it back. All right. All right. Perfect, y'all. Look how I'm bringing my hand back to my face. Ha! It's coming back to my face the whole time. Uh-huh. Hey. Hey. Let's go. Coast one. Y'all got this? Easy. 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 Work. Now, I say easy work helps. Now just say, hello, easy work ain't helping. Smile. Oh, and everybody smile. Remember, my class is about having fun. When you have fun, you get so much energy. People say, hello. How do you get up there and teach like that? If I have fun. When I get tired, I, I just smile. That's why you always see my teeth. Power coast two. One more. There we go. Ha! Turn that rear foot. Remember that story I told you about Aaron? And he opens it up. Bang! Turn. Twist. Yes. You have to open up your hips. And the only way you open up your hips is by turning that rear foot. Look at some of the knockout power guys who knocks people out with that rear hand. They twisting that back leg. Hey. All right. One more. Hey. There we go. Now we're going into round four. This is mental fitness. This is now when we're going to put it together a little bit. Like, I like this because it makes you remember telephone number. We forget about how to do telephone number. These combinations teaches you what number comes next. Like remember the telephone number. So, you're going to go. You're going to give me one. Bring it back. You're going to drop down. Give me two to the body. Bring it back. Remember this one. Come up. Give me a three. All right? So one, drop, two to the body, come up, three. All right? And then the next one is you're going to give me four to the face, three to the face. You're going to drop down and give me six to the body. All right? Anytime you do body shots, you want to drop down and give me six to the body, turning that rear, and come up. All right? So the first one. It's one, two to the body, three. You ready, y'all? Slow first. Don't go too ham. Ready? Let's go. One to the body. Then down. Two to the body. Come up. Three. Yes. One to the face. Drop down. Two to the body. Come up. Three to the face. Yes. One to the face. Drop down. Two to the body. Come up. Three to the face. Perfect, y'all. One. Drop. Two to the body. Up. Three. All right, we get ready to do that four. Ha. Come on, three. All right, let's come in. Finish this combination out first. All right, now we're giving four to the face, three to the face, drop down, six to the body. Again, four to the face, three to the face, drop down, six to the body. All right, four to the face, three to the face, drop down, six to the body, come up, yes, four. Three, drop down, six, perfect, four, three, down, six, all right. We're going back to the first combination. One, drop, two to the body, three to the face. One to the face, drop down, two to the body, come up. All right, remember, this is mental. You're remembering stuff now. When you gotta remember, your brain has to work. And when your brain has to work, it gets stronger. Always challenge your brain. Something new every day. That's mental fitness. Ha. Ha. Perfect. All right, let's go back to the four. The four. Three. And down. Six to the body. Yeah. All right, so when we do the next round, I want y'all to go fast. I want to see y'all try to speed it up a little bit. 
Let's see how well your brain can remember the combination. All right? See how quick you can do it. But if you start getting sloppy, I want you to go back to slow again. Because the mental game ain't dead yet. All right, ready? Let's see. Let's work. Ha, ha, ha. Yes. One, two to the body. Three to the body. Uh-huh. One, two, three. Come on, y'all. Y'all got it. Ha, bang. Perfect. Ha, ha, bang. Yes. Ha, ha, bang. About to do it one more time. Then four, three, six to the body's coming up. Mental game. Ha, ha, bang. You can pause in between to get it right. Go. Ah, four, three, six. Yes, to the body. So make sure you turn that rear and drop the leg down when you hit that six. You see how I'm dropping? I'm up, I drop, and I hit that six. Yes. Ha, ha, bang. Yeah. Make sure when you hit that six, that palm is facing you the whole time. Bang. Yes. Body shots. Stop fights. My boy Canelo. Well, he... Not my boy, I don't know him, but I like to say he's my boy. Body shots, body make him go night, night. All right, y'all, we got two more rounds. Listen, this next one, we're gonna just make the combination a little longer. Now remember, it's about progress, not perfection, all right? When I look for perfection, it's for progress. The more you do it, the better you get, all right? So remember, we're adding the one, we're now adding them together. Drop down and add the two. Then you're gonna come back up and add the one. Then you're gonna drop down and hit four to the body. All right? So one, two to the body. One, four to the body. Now I want you to not pause no more. As I throw the one, when I throw the two, you drop down. As I throw the one, I come up. As I throw the four, I come here, all right? And then we got elevators, one, two. You're just going here, up, and down. But don't bend your back. Bend your legs, all right? Take it slow, first round. Ready, let's go. We got one to the face, two to the body. One to the face, four to the body. Do it again. One, two to the body. One to the face, four to the body, all right? One, elevator, up, down. See how my body's going up and down? Here, here, down. Yeah, it's a mind thing. Tricking the mind, hitting levels. Uh. Hitting levels, y'all. Huh. Yes. All right, elevators. One, twos. Up and down. Bend your legs. Remember, the one, twos are long. See how my arms are long? They're not short. We're working on the legs as we're working on the shoulders. Remember, it's about progress, not perfection. So don't try to make everything perfect. If you start getting sloppy, slow it down. Bring your hands back to your face. Once you hit it, start speeding it up. All right, combination. Let's go. One, two to the body. Here, two, yes. One, two to the body. One to the face, four to the body. You see that levels? Yes. Them levels will kind of trick your brain. That's why I put them in there. You saw how it was tricking my brain and I made it up. Okay? Ha, 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 ha. Perfect. When you start feeling it, then you start speeding up and adding that power. Wow. Make sure you twist that rear foot. All right, let's go to elevators. Elevator, elevator. So this next time when we do the one, two to the body, one to the face, four to the body, I want you to speed up and hit with power. If you feel comfortable, if you don't, stay the same speed that you was doing it. But if you feel good, I'm giving you permission to show out. Ready, set, let's show out. Ha, 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 bang. Yes. Ha, 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 bang. Perfect, y'all. Ha, ha, bang. Yep. Your legs should be getting to work. Your legs should be burning right now because you're dropping levels. Ha, 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 bang. Uh-huh. you like, oh, my legs like, we don't even talk anymore. Ha, ha. Elevators coming up. Ha. Elevators. Last one. All right, y'all. Take a deep breath. Breathe in your nose. Breathe out your mouth. This is like a little rest because that next round, we're gonna work. Every great boxer always ended 
with a conditioned round. So this next round is all conditioned. So make sure you breathe in your nose, breathe out your mouth. I'm gonna explain what we're doing next. So this is the time to drink water when this round is over. Drink water and listen to what I'm about to tell you. Cause we're about to work. All right, y'all ready? So we're doing coast, one, two. You remember coast, one, two. Coast, one, two, long, right? Then we do burnouts. Now, do you see how I'm hitting up here for the coast? When we do burnouts, you can go low. Burnouts is you go as fast as you can. And then we go straight to five, six coast. Five, six coast, then five, six coast, burnout. And then we go the coast threes and fours, and then we power coast threes and fours at the end. Oh yeah, baby. Your arms gonna get it. Your arms gonna be like, Ooh. all right? So remember, coast one, two, then burnout one, two, coast five, six, burnout five, six, coast three, fours, and then power coast three, fours. Knockout, y'all. This is it. This is what champions are made of. This is the last round. Who is a champion? I know I'm a champion. Are you a champion? We all champions. That's why I'm here with you. So let's go. We're gonna start. The champion starts off light. We fill them out. Let's go. One, two. One, two. One, two. That's it. Nice and long. That's it. All right? So remember, like I said in the beginning, I'm here with you. I am your coach. I'm going to feel everything that you feel. If y'all working, best believe I'm gonna work. I'm not gonna sit here and tell y'all to work. And the coach don't work and eating, eating donuts and drinking soda. No, I'm drinking and I'm eating. Watch y'all eating proper. Ready, burn out, let's go. Ha, ha, let's go. Hey, hey, come on. Keep up with me or leave me. One of the two. Make sure you breathe in your nose, breathe out your mouth. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah, easy work, easy work, easy work, easy work, easy work, come on, ha, breathe, come on, I can't believe I'm talking doing this, oh my god, Woo. come on, come on, we're about to go to coast five and six, that's when we catch our breath, ha, five and six, coast and march, y'all, five and six, coast, ha. breathe, and your nose, all right, catch it up, because we're about to do burnout five and six, all right, make sure they come back to your face. 15 seconds. It's a championship round, y'all. I'm feeling what y'all feeling. Come on. I don't quit, you don't quit. If you don't quit, I don't quit. Well, I can quit. <laughs> Ready, set, burn out, let's go. Five to six. Keep up with me or leave me. Come on, come on. Championship round. Palms facing you. That's one. Threes and threes and fours coast is coming up. Come on now. Come on. When the mind, when the body gives up, the mind takes over. Let's go. Let's go. Threes and fours. Twist that lead. Twist that rear. Just you just getting the, the, the feel of it. You're getting the feel of it. That's it. But the power's coming. In 20 seconds. I want you to try to knock his bag down. Mike Tyson style. Knock it down. Get ready. Ten seconds, you. Three is it? Get ready. Three, two, one. That's knockout. Knock it out, y'all. Knock it out. Knock it out, the boy. Yes. Make sure you twist your body. Ha, 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 let's go, Woo! I feel it baby, ha, ha, this is for everybody who used to bully me at school, ha, where y'all at, 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 I'm sorry, I had a moment, I had a moment, I had, I had to take my mind somewhere, you know, because I, I was dying, but when I put my mind in the place where it was dark, I had to breathe. So y'all, that was easy work. So everybody stop, breathe in your nose, breathe out your mouth. Breathe in your nose, breathe out your mouth. Two more time, in your nose, out your mouth. One more, in your nose, out your mouth. 
Good job, y'all. Take your gloves off. That's what I call easy work. So now we're going to do the most important thing of a workout that a lot of people skip, and that's called stretching. When stretching is very important, y'all. When you get finished your workout, you have to stretch. The more your body gets flexible, the better that you can be in boxing, better you can be in any sports that you side, decide to do, it all starts with flexibility. So let's take one hand and bring it across. Always warm down. Don't just stop and leave. I see so many people box and they just go home. I see so many people at the gym. They just lift weights and stuff and they just leave. Stretching is very important after your workout. Mobility work is important before your workout. What we did in the beginning is called mobility work. What we're doing now is flexibility work. Lengthening the muscles. All right? We got three, two, one. Release nice and slow. And other side. That's why I tell people, stretch. I had 12 knee surgeries. Yes, 12 knee surgeries. And y'all probably wondering, how are you still up there doing what you're doing, Flo? Because the mobility and flexibility is saving me. I was supposed to have a knee replacement two years ago. And I started doing my research. And I found out mobility and flexibility saved a lot of people. We're supposed to have knee replacement. Please take one hand, grab oxygen. And that's what I started doing. And it saved me. And that's why I'm telling y'all something that I went through and I'm telling y'all now. Start getting in mobility and flexibility before your workout and after your workout. And watch how incredible you become in anything that you decide. That's why so many athletes are so good now. Because they understand mobility and flexibility. And it leads to the end. So, some of the stretches that I don't, if you feel your lower body is stretched and I don't get it, make sure that y'all do that at the end as well. Because I'm trying to hit part of the body that we... Just dead because we've a whole bunch of punching. So I really want to loosen up these arms and the shoulders and release. Put your hands on your hips. Just rotate your hips. Just loosen up because I know a lot of people have low back problems. All right. Switch to the other side. We got 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And give yourself a round of applause. So listen. So y'all have done my first chapter of my workout. But my next chapter is coming up. It's called Combination Buildup. It's another brain one. And please, and when y'all go do the Combination Buildup, you're going to get another piece of a story about me, how I got started in the fight camp, and how I got started training fighting. So thank y'all for joining me for the six-round pure punching open boxing workout with your boy, Flo Master. Till next time. See ya on the flip flop. Yo, check it. I gotta ask y'all one question. Just one question. Can I get?